Hello everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I am here to talk about a new topic called Notify plugin, service non notify plugin and Twilio direct plugin. So these two plugins are to notify the user on the task from the task table. Okay. So first of all, uh, notify plugin um, is a plugin which help you to send communication like send a uh, message, bulk message or um, send or create a conference call. So that helps you to notify plugin from the notify plugin. And there is a Twilio direct um, application which help you to connect between this notify plugin and your Twilio communication. So there is also one more for the zoom integration connector. But today we will talk about the Twilio direct application. Okay. So today we'll uh, discuss that how we can um, connect to that service now to the Twilio through the notify plugin. In my previous video, I already talked about that Twilio and service now integration. If you if you have not seen that, just go through that. That's a custom application. But today we'll talk about that out of box application whatever the things provided by service now by default out of box okay so basically to implement that you need to be activate two plugin that is called notify plugin as uh, com dot snc notify and another is that notify twilio direct this plugin so uh, this is the new plugin uh, and sorry so this is not the deprecated. The deprecated is the first one. So to notify Twilio is the deprecated. That is the old version, but they recently introduced the notify Twilio direct, which is the plugin which help you to communicate um, from service now to any external like that that help you to call, create the conference call, or send the notification from the SMS. So that's all about this notify plugin. So I'll show you that step by step how you can configure this notify plugin and then I'll um, show you that how what are the steps you need to perform in the Twilio account also. Okay. So before we proceed that I just want to show you that how what are the things happening through this Twilio application or through this notify plugin. I'll quickly show you the demonstrate and then I will show you step by step. So in my instance, I already installed this plugin, notify plugin and notify uh, Twilio direct plugin, this one. You can already see in there, this application, this is a separate scope application, Twilio direct driver. So this one I already activated. So now I'm going to, I'm going to quickly show you that how it will be behave and then I'll go by one by one to demonstrate what are the things you need to be configured for notify plugin. So once you install these two plugins, uh, notify and notify uh, Twilio direct plugin, if you type the notify, you will be able to see this module, this notify module. And then from there only you can do a lot of things. Okay. So let me quickly go through this demo first and then I'll show you that configuration part. Okay. So uh, as I told, that this integration will be work on any of this task table. Let me open to that incident table quickly. So I'm going to open any incident here. And in the incident table, you can see there will be two button. Call send SMS and start conference call. Okay. So if I click the start conference call, there will be one pop up initiated and you can see you can add as many as user here and create a conference call. So right now, as I told that I am using the trial account, I can only send or call, add call to my mobile number or trusted mobile number. But in future, um, you can be able to like if you upgrade your tool account you can be able to send or you can be create conference call with the multiple people so let me uh, you can add the user like that if the user is added you can see my num uh, my name was showing as a red color previously because um, my number is not added here so let me add manually you can add manually so I'm going to click the phone adding my number add selected and test and it will be create one conference call for me and it will 
call me in my mobile so click the start call it will i'll receive one call see and here this conference call number is showing here i just cut the phone and logs also it's showing that notify conference call this is the number okay and now if i go to the notify module you can see uh, there is a call and the conference call this module here right so if i open this calls module it will show that from which task it is generated right so 10037 for 10037 this conference call is added and the direction is uh, outbound okay and you can see this if i open the conference call module here also i will see the track you can see this cc1002 number that is showing that conference call started and in the your logs it is showing that number cc001102 that is present here see and the source is 10037 is the task number let me open that and here you will be able to see all these conference participants okay so that's how you can uh, basically send the conf uh, uh, generate a conference call if you want to send the sms the you can also send the bulk sms click the send sms i have this guided to initiated that's why it's coming up so let me remove that and add this um, phone number adding my phone number and test sms i'll quickly receive one sms once i click that oh i have not added you can see uh, let me add this user and now click that so it will send one sms to my phone directly and you can see uh, it's just popped up my mobile and you can see in the logs it is showing that recipient is this okay now as i told if you remember in in i just quickly show you that when this will be happen when this call will be happen it will be generate some workflow i will show you later that how or where from the workflow is defined but you can see this once this is done once that call is generated or once uh, this sms is sent it it will generate one um, workflow i'll quickly go to that active context and you can see this notify rejoining conference call this is generated okay so this workflow will be generated based on your um, whenever you are generating okay so this config this workflow will be defined under this one i will quickly show you those later okay so let me uh, um, just configure those configuration and then i will show you that <coughs> to configure this notify plugin first of all i as i already told that you need to be installed to plugin the notify plugin and notify direct plugin to your notified to your direct plugin once you install that you will be able to see this module the, once you type the notify you will be able to see and second step is that you have to visit at Twilio. okay so this is the my trial account i am going to use all these things through my trial account so for the trial accounts first if you already you have not seen that how to get this trial number you can go through my previous video so first of all you have to get your trial number and from there only you can send message or you can call okay so first you have to get the trial number so if you have not seen that how to get the trial number go and see my uh, previous video the Twilio configuration and the second thing is that you have to add some trusted number okay so as it is my trial account i can only send certain peoples okay i can only send uh, or i can only call my mobile number or the trusted number that i have added 
So if you want to add some trusted number also you can go through my refer my previous video and add you can add some trusted number. But once you upgrade once you upgrade your Twilio account you don't need to add the trusted number you can add or you can call as many people as you want from the Twilio. So you can see my trial balance is uh, 14.22 dollar right now but once I'll um, start creating um, some calls or start sending message from my account then uh, that they will deduct some money from here okay so the point is that this is only for the demonstration so once you go through uh, this once you configure and show the demo once you pay upgrade this instance upgrade this project you don't need to uh, worry about your um, this number so so I added some trusted number and I get my trial number so that is my first configuration I have done if you have not seen go through uh, go my previous video now second thing is that I need that um, account ace ID okay so let me go to that first what configuration I have to done so in my notification plugins once I activated two plugins so I can see in the under the administration to uh, this module called Twilio direct configuration I have to click here and here as you can see no connected Twilio uh, you can see there is no connected Twilio and also if I click the number you can see there is no number certain number so after activate this configuration to your direct configuration my trial number will be present here okay so let's do that so if I go to the Twilio direct configuration here I have to put that account CS ID account S ID so copy this account S ID here and paste here that is the first step second step is that you have to copy this auth token so copy this auth token and paste it here and now click the connect once you click that the Twilio from the service now it will connect to the Twilio okay so no Twilio messaging or notify service is found okay so that's fine so okay so it's saying that I don't have subscription for a bulk SMS for the timing because I, I am using the trial account that's fine so once I activated this one you can see there are few parameters and this number the trial number 96849 last digit is that nothing but the trial number that I am seeing in my Twilio dashboard that number is added to my phone number okay and then um, once I go to this number modules right now I should be able to see this 964 uh, this 849 this number is added here okay and you can see there is a notify group okay so notify group is that group you have to be create initial okay so you have to create certain notify group so once you install the plugin by default uh, service now provided some uh, group you can see that conference call group notify on call on task group on call group these are the groups the provided okay so for this number by default it's assigned to that conference call group which is the basically this group conference call group if you want to change you can change that okay so that's whenever you are actually going to activate uh, for multiple accounts you can add multiple number okay for the big organization so in the notify group you can uh, you can see um, in below this number is showing here so whenever this num whenever any call will be happen that will be uh, from this notify group okay and there are four field incoming call workflow outgoming call workflow incoming sms workflow outgoing call sms workflow so any any call will initiated from the service now this workflow will be triggered notify call uh, this conference call and any incoming message will receive this workflow will be triggered any outcoming call whenever we will be initiated from the service now this workflow will be triggered and uh, outgoing going sms 
this workflow will be triggered okay so this workflow you can customize if you want okay but these are the things provided by the service now by default by activating these two plugins okay so we activated the plugins add the number to the tool or direct configuration and we see that this number is added here and it attached one notify group and then in the notify group we see that this workflow is attached so these verification steps are done okay now if we go to the notify properties you can see these are the in the property we this is enable so in the task it is enable so if you turn off so Twilio application will be disabled for the time being okay and then once this is done you can you can go to this uh, any of this task table like incident problem change and you will be able to see the options for mass sending the message and creating the conference call okay i'll quickly show you those button if i go to the incident and open any incident like this one I am just opening you can see this button that sent SMS start conference call so this button will be available once you configure these things once you uh, activate these things okay so once you activate the notify plugin once you activate the Twilio direct you will be able to see these two button and this will be active actually going to send the bulk message and it will uh, start conferencing call okay so if you if you um, have any question or uh, comments in my video or maybe you can ping me in whatsapp or if you need any customization you can directly reach out to me in whatsapp okay thank you very much have a great day We'll see in my next video.